In Hanson, Kentucky, some family and friends of those who've passed away say the city is disrespecting their loved ones who are buried at the Hanson Cemetery. But city officials say new rules have been in place there since December. Eyewitnesses to Sharon McBroom with the story. When family and friends have to bury their loved ones, it's always a difficult time, but some families say the loss is just one unfortunate circumstance they've had to deal with. Judy Miller, who lost her son two years ago, says her and her daughter-in-law have really been hurt on how they feel the Hanson Cemetery has done their loved one. Well, before the rules even changed, I had had a custom Harley Davidson wreath made for my son. Brought it out here, 200 bucks. And because it wasn't Memorial Day, I couldn't have it here. Hanson Mayor Jim Epley says the city is not trying to disrespect plots and decorations, but want residents to understand the rules are in place for a reason. We changed the rules. Uh, there were just uh, so many loose items and stuff that uh, it was getting hard to keep them off the ground so that we can do the maintenance that we need to do. Miller says her and her daughter-in-law tried to go to the city council meeting, but they were told that the Hanson Cemetery subject was not being discussed. I mean, it's, it's a disgrace not only to me and other people that's been here forever, to the veterans that they destroyed their stuff. Mayor Epley says the strong winds the area has seen has scattered items across the cemetery, but wants those who have family members at the cemetery to know they are not trying to disrespect them. We're not disrespecting anyone, whether veterans or anything. I'm a veteran. We're not trying to differentiate against anyone, and we want to make it as best we can, but we have to maintenance problems we have to take care of. And even with the bad weather in the region, Miller says she is not convinced that this is a reason the items were moved. We had bad winds, what, last Friday? Tornado warnings? I was here Saturday. Everything was still here. I mean, it's just, it's disrespectful. In Hanson, Kentucky, DeSherry McBroom, Eyewitness News.